Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Ask Anthony, where I take off your burning life advice questions and tell you how to tell them that someone's creeping. And just before we start, please don't forget to drop me a comment down below and hit that like button if you like anything that I have to say. Also, don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this where I answer your life advice questions every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Also, hit me up on social media under the hashtag AskAnthony where you can get your life advice question answered in a video just like this. Now, my friend Tasha of the one and only Simply BT's fam asks, how to tell a friend their boyfriend or girlfriend is cheating? Ooh, juicy. And guys, don't forget to go stop by Tasia and her family's YouTube channel, Simply BT's, and subscribe. And also follow them on social media. Trust me, their vlogs are so great because their little boys remind me of me and my brother at that age so much. So, you just saw your friend's man or woman creeping. You just saw them doing a human reenactment of that lady in the tramp pasta scene through the window of that Italian restaurant right across the street. Mm -hmm. And they just so happen to be with that one person that always be popping up in their Instagram pictures, yet they always claim that he or she is just a really close friend. I mean, he slash she is basically like my brother slash sister. Yeah, like the brother and sister from Cruel Intentions, hmm? Let's just say you have undeniable proof, right? You caught them right in the act. And you're about to go all Solange on their cheating ass, except you're not trying to catch a battery charge, so you decide whether or not you should tell your friend. Now, to arrive at our answer, we first must examine all possible outcomes of our actions. Scenario number one, you don't tell your friend he or she wastes their time with this person for who knows how much longer. The relationship finally ends and you tell your friend about it after they broke up. Your friend says that you're an asshole for not telling them sooner. Scenario number two, you don't tell your friend about it, they break up. You continue to remain silent forever. Either that or you play dumb and act like you had no idea that the ex was the cheating type. Scenario number three, you don't say anything and your friend's now about to say I do to this person. It now makes for a really awkward time to tell them about all of their cheating ways. Scenario number four, you say nothing, then you say nothing at the wedding and you remain silent for years and then they end up cheating on your friend again and the marriage is ruined and you become overwhelmed with guilt. Scenario number five, you tell your friend and they just get super defensive about it and say that you're just jealous. Cause I mean, that happens when you tell them that their girlfriend or boyfriend is a cheating son of a Or they just stop talking to you altogether. That is until your friend realizes that you told them the truth and they come back apologizing to your friends again. Scenario number six, your friend believes you and tells their girlfriend or boyfriend to go off and then you become best friend of the century. Now, just based on all of these scenarios, I would say the best results are associated with telling your friend. So, now that we've decided that telling our friend is probably the right thing to do, how do we go about the whole conversation? Honestly, there is no easy way to go about it, so I would employ the band-aid rip technique. You know what I'm talking about, do it quick and get it over with. So get to the point, tell your friend what's going on, and if you have pictures, even better. Then you don't even gotta say shit. You can just hold your phone in front of them. But make sure that you have the what, the when, the where all ready to go because when you tell your friend this news, they're gonna wanna make sure that your story checks out and you wanna seem 100% reliable here. But regardless of how your friend reacts, telling them is the right move here. And if your friend attacks you, them. You're just trying to help out. You're just trying to prevent them from wasting their time with somebody who doesn't respect them enough to not hook up with some random from the hot dog stand. Now, don't get me wrong. This is not going to be an easy conversation to have. Matter of fact, it's probably going to be severely uncomfortable. Like, more uncomfortable than watching a movie with your parents when it cuts to a sex scene. That kind of uncomfortable. But I know if I was in the same situation, I would want my friends to tell me. And once again, we arrive back at that whole empathy discussion. And don't worry, this is not considered snitching. Because you probably like your friend a lot more than you like their cheating ass girlfriend or boyfriend, so it's fine. Just bite the bullet and do the right thing. Sharing is caring. Anyway, thank you so much, Tazel, for that really, really juicy question. And guys, don't forget to go stop by Tazel's YouTube channel, Simply BTs, and subscribe and follow them on all of their other social media. And until next time, keep those life advice questions coming in via social media to hashtag AskAnthony and help me help you.